patients were randomized into two arms um, for enrollment purposes, but the purpose of the trial was not to compare the two arms. Um, there were 23 patients enrolled in the combination Alaparib plus Dervalumab arm, and um, 22 patients were enrolled in the Alaparib arm. The vast majority of patients received first-line platinum-based chemotherapy, and patients had to have um, clinical benefit after at least three cycles of platinum-based chemotherapy. Um, most of the patients in the clinical trial um, had sporadic triple negative breast cancer, meaning that they did not harbor germline BRCA mutations. Um, there were only seven patients enrolled in the clinical trial that had germline BRCA mutations. And essentially, um, what we found, uh, the primary endpoint was progression-free survival. And in the single agent Alaparib arm, the progression-free survival was about four months. And in the Alaparib plus Dervalumab arm, the progression-free survival was six months. And in both arms, about 20% of patients were still ongoing on this chemotherapy-free maintenance strategy. Um, at the data cutoff. So we certainly found patients in both arms that did derive benefit um, from a chemotherapy-free maintenance strategy in triple negative breast cancer, which has never been done before. A few signals that we found in terms of who actually were those patients that, that may derive benefit from a strategy like this, we did find that patients um, that had a true response, so either a partial response or a complete response to platinum, um, had longer progression-free survival. So in the Alaparib arm, the median progression-free survival in those that had a true CR or PR to platinum was about five and a half months. And in the Alaparib plus Dervalumab arm, in those true responders, it was about seven and a half months. Um, and certainly the patients that had germline BRCA mutations did a little bit better than those that did not, um, which is not surprising. Um, we have robust correlative analyses that are ongoing to also still try to determine who those patients are that had benefit from this strategy, including um, whole genome sequencing, HR detect, uh, methylomics. Uh, we also have some CTDNA, um, and we hope to report those uh, in the next year.